That is insanely tiny. Oh my gosh, warrior. Hmm, <laughs> interesting. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna do another unboxing. I've got some products from Flower Beauty, ColourPop, from Ulta's latest 21 day sale. <laughs> so yeah, let's just jump into it. The first one I've got here is from Ulta, from their latest sale. Let me see. Okay, so first we've got I'm not 100% sure how great this is. The reviews were like half and half. I don't know if it's going to be good or not, but this is the Skin Glazing Blush by Nabla. And it does look like there's some shimmer in it. I want to open it up real quick and see if... I just kind of want to swatch this. I was very curious about it since the ratings were very 50-50. Oh, it looks so pretty. So a lot of people said it didn't show up, but I mean, it's showing up on my skin, so I'm not, I guess on camera, at least I'm on my screen, it's not really showing up, but in person, it definitely shows up. It's very pretty. It looks a lot like, at least the, the appearance looks a lot like ColourPop's Super Shock Shadow, or I guess Super Shock blushes. <laughs> I went ahead and bought an e.l.f. monochromatic multi-stick in the shade Bronze Cherry. I try to find items that are easier for people like me who have issues with their hands. I've said it a hundred times. I'm just saying it for people who haven't seen the videos. But this looks so cool. I'm actually really excited to use this. So it's a little bitty thing. And imagine how easy this would be for traveling. I mean, I don't travel, but there's people who do travel. And it's just a little stick. In the screen, it looks kind of orangish, but it's definitely bronze cherry. A bronzy cherry. I really like cream blushes right now, and they're amazing. They're one of the cheapest cream blushes on the market right now, and they work just as well as high-end products. So I went ahead and picked up another shade in Bali, and it's a deeper, um, uh, it's like a deeper brownie red, I guess you would call it. Uh, I've got... Tahiti and Turks and Caicos and I love both of those as well so I know I'll love this. I've never heard of this brand ever but it had great reviews so I figured might as well try it. It is the Herborean, Herborean, not sure if I said that right, Korean Skin Therapy CC Cream High Definition Radiance Face Cream and I love CC creams and BB creams, so I figured this would be fun to try out. I think there was three, I believe there was three shades, maybe two, and I got the medium shade. I think it's Doré, maybe? I want to see what it looks like. So it comes out white, and I guess when you put it on your face, it will turn into your skin color which it definitely just did that on my arm. So super excited about that one. From CVS, I picked up the L'Oreal Paris True Match Nude Tinted Serum 1% Pure Hyaluronic. So this is the insanely overhyped foundation. It's got 50-50 reviews again. That is the like consistency of it. It's pretty liquidy. I would say it's between a, like a thick foundation and a really really runny foundation so I think it's kind of leaning more towards the liquidy side but I am very very excited to use that as well I will use it in a video soon the next box we have is flower beauty I just like really went in deep with that knife gloves god I'm so weak alrighty I bought a bunch of flower beauty stuff a while back and I bought two different shades and they were both extremely pale. So on their website I used like the regular, hey I'm a light to medium shade on the neutral side. Every single time with like almost every brand I get shades that are super light. 
I don't know why, because I'm following their description. I don't like that because I don't return makeup. I usually just repurchase it. So I got the Flower Lash Warrior, Warrior, I can't say that. So the Flower Lash Warrior, <laughs> Warrior, Warrior. <laughs> <laughs> uh, mascara in fiercest black I'm excited to use this one as well then I picked up my third shade of flower beauty in the shade no idea it does not say I don't know oh let me, let me get the packing stuff put up Classic Tan. I've gotten the two foundations under it, I believe is what it was. Super light. This actually looks light too. I don't know. And I'm not even like that tan of a person. I mean, I'm like tan, but not tan tan. So, no, that one, that one actually might work. And if it doesn't, that looks a little dark. So if it's too dark, I will just throw in some of the super light foundation. I got the Petal Pout Lip Mask. I'm very very excited for this one I saw someone use it on uh, another YouTube channel I think geek out of water and it just looked it looked awesome I love any kind of like lip masks anything that make your lips feel soft love it I got the flower beauty blush bomb in the shade spiced and I've heard great things about this one so if you're looking for a cream or liquid blush I know that this one is a great one. The e.l.f. blush is also a great one. Let me go ahead and show you a swatch of the Spiced. It's hard because I can't really like swipe on my, my hands because I have to wear these stupid gloves all the time. But, oh my gosh. I've, I used to be one of those people that only like reached for the like Barbie pink or like the lighter pinks. I have been loving the darker tones. I don't know, it's just really pretty. So this is the spiced color and it it's really pretty. And I got one of these free for just placing the order. I got two scribbler sticks in the shade uh, in the shades Sherbert and Marvelous. So I'm so weak, y'all. So the CRPS has actually decreased my strength by 75% in my left leg and 50% in my left hand and around 30% in my right hand. So I kind of struggle sometimes. So just bear with me. Here is the, ooh, and this is a lip and cheek color. So I'm really excited for these. I think these are going to be really awesome. All right, this middle one here is the Marvelous and this bottom one is the Sherbert. Next, we have another Ulta order. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay. So I don't know if you've been following along, you know, I'm in like search for the softest best sponge. So I recently got the Haley sponge. Oh my goodness. Better than elf, better than any sponge I've tried so far. So Haley's beauty is number one so far, but I also picked up the real technique sponge plus I think it is. My voice totally just cracked there like a prepubescent boy. Hmm. So it's called a Miracle Air Blend Sponge. It's supposed to be super soft. There is antimicrobial infusion to help keep skin healthy. Best when used dry. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I am. I'm going to open this up. I got to feel it. So I am super, super excited to try this one out. I will let y'all know if it's any better. Oh my gosh. Ooh, oh my gosh. Y'all, this one is lighter and I don't know how to describe it. It's, it's just, it's different. It's, this is going to be crazy. I'm very excited to test both of these. I will do it in like a whole separate video, like side by side and see which one I like the best. This is also another brand that I've never tried before. It is called DHC. Actually, is DHC the one who makes the oil cleanser that I use? I don't have my phone on me, otherwise I would, I would be looking this up. I think DHC is the oil cleanser that I use. This is a Velvet Skin Coat Primer. It had like 
five star reviews. I'm not one to just pick up primers like that because I'd rather spend it on makeup, but the reviews were just too good to be true almost. So I'm, I'm hoping, oh my God, that was, that is insanely tiny. I definitely thought this was gonna be bigger, especially for its price. I figured this was gonna be a bigger primer. This is kinda, kinda insane. What a letdown. It could be amazing. The only thing is, is I will only purchase it during the 21 day sale because otherwise I won't spend the money on it. Okay, so next we have a ColourPop box. And if I, I, I believe I know what this is and if this is what I've been waiting for for over like a month, month and a half, uh, I cannot wait to share this with y'all. I'm super excited. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Y'all, look at this box. Oh my gosh. It is so pretty. I guess I just didn't expect that. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous box. It's something I'll give my daughter to color on, or maybe I'll keep it. I don't know. Oh, I have, I have issues. Okay, I'm not gonna keep it. I'm gonna give it to my daughter. And of course, they always come with the little thanks a latte cards, which are cute, but a waste of paper. Okay, so I 100% am gonna do. I'm, I'm gonna do a video on this where I test out each color on my eyes so that I can show you. Sorry, it's probably super loud. So I can show you what it looks like. But look at this box, like how cute. It's got all the Disney princesses. <sighs> oh my goodness. Oh, even the packaging, look how cute. It's got all the Disney princesses and the tiaras and in the back it shows all the Disney princesses. And it's called Heart of Gold. That is what this collection is called. And they're all super chalk shadows. So they're not regular eyeshadows. So, oh my gosh. I am just gonna quickly show some of these, but I'm gonna do a video on it later on. This is a dream is a wish your heart makes. And it's like a really pretty blue color. And I'm gonna guess, yeah, this is Cinderella. Oh, this has gotta be tangled. I see the light. Yes. So I see the light is tangled and it's a really pretty purple color. And then Arabian Nights is Jasmine. Oh my gosh, it's like a very gorgeous teal. That is so pretty. I don't know, I don't know what color it's coming across on the screen, but it's like a very green. I don't even want to say teal. It's like leaning towards green. Yeah, it's like a it's just like a pretty iridescent green. I don't know how else to describe it. Touch the sky is merda. And that's a pretty like blue color. They should have done orange because her hair is so orange. That would have been cool. Like real cool. I didn't show any of the, the, the cases, which I'll show in a video, but they've got like their little logos on them. How cute. So that is all I've got for today. I really appreciate you joining me on my unboxing. And I hope that everyone has a great day. If you have chronic pain like me, I hope you have a super, super, super low pain day. That's it for me, y'all. Thanks. Bye.